Originally, the Heasters thought their two and a half month old daughter Maddie had a cold. So did the doctors. But the next day, things drastically changed when she was diagnosed with RSV, an experience they said that was truly humbling. Meg and Chris Heaster thought Maddie had a cold, so they took her to the doctor. They checked her oxygen levels and all of them were at 100 and her fever, she didn't have a temperature. She appeared to be okay, but things quickly changed. The next night, it was a really bad night for her. She was up every three hours. Um, she couldn't get comfortable. Her cough was getting significantly worse. That was enough to know it was time to go to the emergency room where they took her oxygen levels again. They had dropped 20%. Little Maddie not only had RSV, but the rhinovirus too. That's when they said, you know, we think we're going to try to keep her overnight. Terrifying. That's probably the best word. Maddie's oxygen levels remained a challenge. One night turned into four. You know, she's just only two and a half months old. And like Meg said, we've never... We've been thankfully never had to experience anything this major with Jax, um, and uh, so it was scary. Jax is Maddie's big brother, and seeing his sister stick was tough for him, tough for everyone all the way around, an experience many parents were going through. And at that point, we had we knew that the hospital was pretty much at capacity as far as children with RSV. But one thing did make things better the staff. Just the way everything was handled gave us a sense of calm in the midst of, of all of it. Maddie got stronger and eventually came home, bringing with her a new friend. In Elizabethtown, Amber Gerard, WGAL News 8.